team. Hope everyone's having a great day. Uh, I'm, as you can see, me and the coach, baby. We're here at Sky Harbor. Um, there's a big corporate thing going on. So today, we're running airport shuttle. We're back in five nine four like we were yesterday. So there she is. So we're in the cell phone lot over at Sky Harbor. Um, the airport is basically like right here. This is one side, obviously. That's United, or no, that's American. Southwest over there, blah 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 blah, whatever. So, shortly I will be joined by four other buses, three big ones, and then there'll be a mini coach that joins us. Um, and today, your boys in charge of everybody. I'm just playing. but I am the lead driver on this one. So, um, I think there's some new people on this one, so I gotta make sure that they know where they're going, vice versa, so. That's what we got today, people. Airport shuttling all day. Um, they start arriving at like 8.30, so I'll be obviously number one that gets called up. And that's kind of how that works. Instead of uh, sitting up there at the airport in the, uh, on the charter line we come back here and stage in the in the cell phone lot and basically you're you know you just hang tight and wait to be called uh, and then once you get called then obviously you go ahead and go up they'll tell you what terminal um, and they'll say north or south so obviously this will be the south side and then this is our north side of the terminal terminals that run in between so that's kind of how that works and then um they're going to arizona grand resort which i think it's in tempe but they might consider that phoenix not quite sure but we're doing this until i think 3 30. it's 7 30. We're gonna be shuttling for a while. But hey, it's what we do. It's what we get paid for. It's the job. So I'm gonna hang out, um, chill for a little bit. I got breakfast, got my Dunkin'. America runs on Dunkin', you dig? Don't let nobody tell you different. So yeah, we're just gonna sit here, chill, listen to some tunes. And uh, wait to get called up. Or at least wait till the other drivers get here so I can make sure they know what they're doing, where they're going. All right. Peace.
we're chilling. Um, we've been chilling for a while. We were told that the flight lands at 2.45. They were delayed. Oh, excuse me. So this flight went from Chicago to Vegas and then Vegas here. But the, the leg of the trip from Vegas to Phoenix was delayed. So, like I said, they were supposed to land at 2.35. Then they told us 2.30. And then all of a sudden, it's 3.15 and they just landed. So we've been sitting since like 12.30. I've eaten lunch, I've watched a few movies, I, well, I take that back, I've watched a few episodes of one of my TV shows, drove over here, and then, then they just landed, so this is a part of a driving motor coach, sometimes things just don't go according to plan. Um, so you just got to know how to roll with the punches, you know, good thing is you get paid by the hour, so just hang out and chill, um, so this will be the last run for me and Adam, I believe, um, and then the next group of drivers will show up, I think at like six. So, do this last run, take them over to the resort, and then pretty much I'm done for the day after that. Um, tomorrow we're driving for ASU, um, and we'll get into that tomorrow, but yeah. This is, uh, like I said, this is a part of it. So, if you're interested in driving motor coach, please ask questions. Whether it's me or any of your local motor coach companies, wherever you guys may live. If you live in Arizona and you want to get in a driving motor coach, please leave comments below. Ask questions. Make sure you know what you're getting yourself into. Um, and that's not to say it in a bad way. Just understand what you're doing. You're not just driving um, local, you know, around your, your city. In this case, Phoenix, uh, Scottsdale. You know, you, we do, as you see, um, we do travel quite a lot. Some days, you know, you come home every day. And then there's times where you know, woo. Um, as you guys have seen, I mean, I've Cali pretty much the whole month of uh, of May and June. You know, um, for the most part, I've been I've been home so far of July, uh, but that will change starting next week. So again. You gotta make sure you watch the whole clip, the whole video. Cause I'm gonna leave subtle subtleties as far as where we're going. But uh, yeah, so this week we're home. And the next week, Tuesday, we take off somewhere. And I will reveal that in um, in a later vlog coming off coming up this week. So um, but yeah, back to that. If you guys have any questions, whether it's for me, um, whether you ask me or, or you do your research online, whatever it may be, just do some research. Find out what you're doing. Because um, these things are big and you're responsible for every life that's on here. So the way I look at it is I drive this as if my kids are sitting behind me. If I do that, then that guarantees me the, the chance to go back home and see my kids. Um, you know, it's 40,000 pounds by itself. 
give or take a few pounds. And then once you, you know, load up the entire cargo bay and fill every 56 seats back there, it's a lot of weight you've added. You know, probably along the lines of like 10,000 pounds. You know, now let's say, now we're climbing up, we're going to the mountains. Or we're coming down out of the mountains. It's a lot. Uh, there's times where I go home, or there's times I get off the bus, and I am mentally exhausted because of all of the different stuff that you have to be aware of. Uh, you have to pay attention to while you're driving. You know, and the number one excuse uh, when it comes to when one of these buses get hit, I didn't see you. So of course, all the drivers, our response is, we're 12 and a half feet tall, we're 45 feet long, we're eight and a half feet wide. How did you not see us? What were you doing? You were texting, you had to be. But anyway, We'll be back. Well, that's it for today. Officially finished everything. Parked her back in her spot. Now, detail crew will get a hold of her. Get her cleaned up. Yeah, well, for me, I'm going home. You know? Um... this it takes a lot out of it I mean it just completely drains you man Whew. but it's all good hey appreciate you guys rocking with your boy like always like squad give this video a like got changed so Peace.